Elden Ring introduced a lot of new players to the Dark Souls genre. It has done it so well that it has won the Game of the Year award. Rightfully so. While the art style might not be for everyone, the ability to explore the open world and make your own story proved to be challenging yet rewarding each time you were able to get past a certain area and kill a boss that you may not have expected to come across. The amount of internal rage that this game produced was enough to burst all my pimples. But each time that I was able to finally kill a boss and move on to the next section, it felt more rewarding than I had expected. With no set difficulty level, it was up to the player to obtain the right gear and level up your character to become strong enough to finally beat the boss that you kept dying to. However, these challenges were optional, because 5 minutes of research would show some interesting methods of cheesing certain bosses and leveling up your character to a point of cruising through the rest of the game. The lack of handholding in this game was a double-edged sword in my opinion. While it gave you the freedom to explore how you wished and return to areas that you might not have been ready for, the storyline seemed vague for new players that are used to a more structured gameplay. Most of the characters that we come across made us think whether they were truly friends or foe. For those that seek a replayability aspect in a game, Elden Ring is certainly up your alley as there are countless character builds and hidden items to discover across the massive map. I remember each time I unlocked a new area it surprised me that I just kept getting bigger and bigger until I discovered an underground world, at which point it exceeded all my initial expectations. I believe this is what made this game so successful, with many of us not knowing what we were getting ourselves into, the journey of discovery proved to be worth it as each little victory felt more rewarding than the last. It may be a while before we experience a game like Elden Ring. With many developers taking notes, I am sure copycats will come in the near future, but the way Elden Ring was executed will be seen in many games to come. From the open world structure to the crafting and saving mechanism, all of these little factors will come back in a different form. While not all of them will be perfect, Elden Ring has paved the way for the gaming industry in the right direction, restoring hope for many gamers like myself. If you agree or disagree with the topics discussed in this video, Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will keep these videos coming.